new restaurant with a really nice breakfast for 99 Thai baht, which is this place, and it's called Yasmin's Cafe and Restaurant, which is on Central Road, just between Beach Road, okay, and you can see the beach down there, there and uh, Second Road, which is up here. It's, it's located directly in the middle. This is one good-looking puppy. Hey, pup. Shy. How are you going? Very good. Very good looking dog. You're a good looking puppy. Yes, you are. Oh, you want cats, do you? Oh. Alright, I'm looking for flowers. I think I like this white one. Very pretty. Beautiful flowers here in Thailand. It's my heart. Your heart. <laughs> Very nice. A few flowers, kind of fake flowers. We can't have real ones because we're in and out of the country and we use it as a holiday home. But yeah, just trying to, you know, bring the uh, condo to life and uh, you know, give it a uniqueness and a homely feeling. Japanese looking one. Yeah, we're just trying to furnish the apartment at the moment. I'm outside while uh, Arian tries this other florist. She's looking for more flowers. She loves the uh, flowers. Not sure how it'll look. I'm a little bit worried. The flowers, she's very happy doing the interior design of the condo. Just walking now to an antique shop to see what else we can find for the condo. Yeah, and we had some luck the other day. Uh, we went to an antique store on Tepreset and Tepreset um, Antiques, it had some really nice stuff, really good stuff. And uh, I think we bought some vases, some really nice Japanese items, some vases for the flowers and a few other bits and pieces. Really good, double thumbs up. I found this wall in the Big C Extra and it's got all these places for sale and for rent. So for sale or for rent, most likely uh, by the owners. It's got some pretty good prices here, like you know, you can rent that for 9,000 Thai baht per month. That 80 square meter condominium, two bedroom is only 3.9. It looks like they've rubbed out the price and lowered it. There's another uh, cheapy, nine and a half thousand peso. Sorry, I almost said uh, peso. There, well, I did. It's actually nine and a half thousand Thai bar. Wow, 1.4. Another bloody bargain. Look at that, 9,000 per month. Yeah, I've just seen these chaps uh, having a look at the board and one of the blokes was talking about the Philippines and he was saying, you know, Manila, um, it's a bit of a, you know, not so good place, a lot of poverty, uh, a lot of problems there. And I said, look, don't judge the Philippines just based on Manila. Have a look at Subic Bay.
It's beautiful, yeah, it's really nice. It's so nice. Oh! Okay, thank you very much. Some sort of convoy here. We've got a police escort and lots of vans. Van 5, Van 6, Van 7. Maybe government officials, not sure. That's a cool looking bus there. And if you'd like to rent a motorbike, there's some pretty cool bikes here, Harley Davidson's. Check out this one, for example, for rent here in Patia. They even have big Harleys like this. Awesome. Really cool. So babe, can I rent a bike? No. Why not? Everyone's speeding here, I don't know. No. My missus will not let me rent a bike. Yes, it's a bit crazy driving around here, but I would like a bike. I was just saying to Aryan, there's a huge bike culture here in Patia. Like a heavy bike, like a Harley Davidson. Looking for the antique store now. It's not the easiest to find with these small little back alleys and streets. Oh, is this it? And that wasn't it. Maybe it's uh, down here somewhere. Down one of these toys. And this is another condominium project by the name of Apis, which is quite nice and worth mentioning. Apis is worth checking out and it's very close uh, to Central Road and Big C Extra. Yeah, I quite like it. And big balconies here at Apis. That's part of the reason why I do like it. Cool looking bike. Real flowers, very pretty. Alright, so we couldn't find this other antique store by the name of Cheap Charlie's, but what we did find in a back street are these cute little kind of like townhomes here in the back streets of Patia. So we thought we'd just, you know, walk down this and kind of give you guys an idea of. You know what the housing looks like here now this is very very close this is you know, in between second and third road very very close to the city and uh, pubs and bars and clubs and that sort of thing and something like this you can probably rent from anywhere from like say from about 14 to 16 thousand Thai baht maybe even cheaper if you're lucky that's a beautiful home, that one. Most definitely. Look at the gate on this one, hold on. And this house has a little rotunda in the garden. Nice little corner allotment. Even has a mango tree. Look at that, beautiful. This one even has a old drift car. Looks like a Nissan Sapphira. <laughs> Very cool. Got a cute little golden lion. This one. Nice house. This too. Thai style and this housing complex um, backs on the back of Apis condominiums nice Mercedes there too just notice these are fireworks it looks like pretty flower here
looks like just behind me, just there to my left hand side, there's a guy doing it a bit rough. He's had a big night out. Yeah, it must have been an epic night. Poor bloke. Interesting looking shop houses here. This is a cute looking cafe. 